listening to Second Chance Ministry Radio. Hi, I'm Jerry Hill with Together in the Harvest. And today I want to talk to you about Galatians 2.20. And it says, I have been crucified with Christ. It is no longer I who live, but Christ lives in me. And the life which I now live in the flesh, I live by the faith of the Son of God, who loved me and gave himself for me. When I came to Christ and I found out that he had died for me, I gave my life to him, but then when I learned this scripture, I knew that I had to die to myself, and everything in my past, and all of the emotions and things that come up in my life, all of my mentality, and the way that I thought I had to start dying to the way that I had been thinking, and the emotions that I had, that there was so much more, and learning him drawing close to Him and finding His way and dying to my ways and finding God's ways. Letting His thoughts become my thoughts. Let His ways become my ways. And when He asked me to do something, I died to myself. I wanted to live for Him and let Him be the one that flowed through me and lived through me. But it's a process. It does not happen overnight. And when you get married, you have to die to yourself. When you start having kids, you have to die to yourself. You're not always going to be doing everything that you want to be doing, but you are sacrificing for others. And it's to have the right attitude in that sacrifice that you bring honor and glory to God. Let's all die to ourselves and become alive in God in what He has in store for us. And I want to pray with you right now. Father, I lift up each person that's listening right now, and I pray, Lord, that you would draw them so close to you, that you would touch and anoint their lives, Lord Jesus, that they will learn how to die to themselves and be alive in their relationship with you, that you become the most important thing in their lives. In Jesus' name, amen. You are listening to Second Chance Ministry Radio.